Check them out off the list. Uh, I'll, I'll get their names and then uh, I'll give you a call back. Okay, just go ahead and see okay. what we said. This here is an M4 carbine rifle. Mm -hmm. um, my personal experience, I've shot this, uh, shot the M16, A2, and I've shot this. Uh, I find this to be, I think that it's a better weapon. Uh, it's just as accurate. All right, it's got a shorter barrel. Uh, it's got a tighter rifling, so actually statistically it is just as accurate and it's a lot easier to carry a lot lighter so it's prefer preferable to most soldiers I would think. Okay, good. That's Well, they get you scanning, and I'll show you that. His battery's low. Now I'm going to go up. Uh, what? His battery's low. No, it's got a switch on it. It makes it burn. Oh. Uh. Beautiful. If you take take this weapon compared to M16A2, it's a far superior weapon. It's a lot lighter, more mobile, and it also has a good close quarter combat capabilities. The one that you could fire it with one hand, two hands. It's got the same range as the M16A2. But when you're lugging this thing around, it saves, it saves you a lot of heartache, especially uh, when you're humping. And a lot of guys around here are humping through the uh, streets of Baghdad here. And it's just far superior. That's pretty much it. Okay. Question I have, look over here. Has that thing ever saved your life? Has it ever saved my life? Yes. It has, but, I mean, it saved everybody's lives over here. Everybody that has one, it's, it's saved their life. Uh, I think the M4 is a lot better than the M16. Yeah, it's shorter. It makes it easier to get in and out of Humvees. It's a lot lighter too. So. Yeah. Has it ever saved your life, or you know somebody that has? Uh, well, the 82nd one was here last deployment. It saved everybody's life here, but it hasn't saved my life yet. I haven't seen any combat. Anything I don't like about it? You like that really you can see it in the bank and all that. Just the mobility of it, it being shorter and makes it easier to clear a room. Perfect. I'm Sergeant Moreland of the 3rd Battalion, 325th Airborne Infantry Regiment of the 82nd Airborne Division. And I think the uh, M4 carbine is a versatile weapon. It's a good weapon for mount operations as well as uh, field applications. It's a short weapon with a collapsible buttstock which can be uh, collapsed for clearing buildings and rooms and also extended for a uh, good firing position for long distance and accurate uh, firing and uh, well-placed shots. I think it's a uh, better M16. It's shorter, a lighter, cops with butt stock. Uh, you can put all these uh, the aiming devices on it and better for clearing rooms. So you would say it's a better tactical weapon than the Yeah, I think. Very bad. It make a okay, it's a uh, better, way better tactical weapon. Uh, I think the M4 is a good weapon. I like it because it's light. I like it because the uh, rail mount system. I like it because uh, it's smaller in size than M16. Uh, I like the collapsible stock. Uh, I think it's a very accurate weapon, and uh, I like it because uh, the shells, uh, you know, the carrying ammunition and stuff, it's not as heavy, and. Uh, It's a collapsible buck stock. We'll go down different, <clears throat> all the way down to different sizes of length. Okay. Sights. 
got a CCO, just like a red dot sight, okay. more or less. Mm-hmm. All right. Any other special features? I know you got two uh, two magazines there. Mm-hmm. That's just uh, for holding. That's uh, two magazines. You got one in the well, <clears throat> the other one clips on. So it's for quick release. Press the button, release, and then go to your next magazine after you've already emptied one magazine. Very nice, very nice. Okay, moving up. Is the other speech features beyond that to the next level? You have a pack four. And what's that for? Uh, it's for at night. So when you're wearing your uh, nods, your night vision goggles, okay. you're uh, able to see. It puts out a uh, beam of infrared light. And you're able to see, uh, put a, a sight on the target. Okay. And on this side over here, All right. I have a tack light, which is also mounted. So when you enter a room or you need some extra light in a dark area, so all you have to do is press the button on the rear, and it lights up. Cool.